what's up guys, Chex here, welcome to Hammerwatch, the game I have hardly an idea how to play. Alright, so we have two campaigns, we have Castle Hammerwatch, Temple of the Sun, and we've got several classes. We have Paladin, Wizard, Ranger, Warlock, Thief, Priest, Paladin, there we go, and we have difficulties, we have Medium, Hard, Easier, Medium. That was exciting. Alright, so we're gonna go as a Paladin in Castle Hammerwatch, and oh no, the bridge, oh no, my, my, uh, my... Oh, see if you can find a way out. We'll wait here. Okay, so my... Looks like my squadron of very men is waiting for me. As I... Oh, okay, there we go. Uh, so... Okay, here we go. We are controlling our paladin. And immediately we are in the Legend of Zelda, smashing pots. Beetles. I hate beetles. So far I've killed about 5 beetles, 7 bats, and 12,000 pots. Things are going well. Well, it looks like over there we've got a damsel in distress surrounded by many, many pots. Which one do we get first? A passage of sin revealed! You know, this is actually how Batman got his fear of bats, not that secret basement under his house. Yeah, he just played this game. They're coming. They're all dead. Smash through the beetle! Smash, smash, smash! Yeah, that, that keyboard sound you can hear is actually how fast I am clicking on my keyboard so that I can attack all these pots. Oh yeah, and some beetles. Alright, so over there we have some beetles, and then to the left we have some apples and a present. I think Santa might have been murdered here. There are so many beetles here, it's like a teenage girl in America in the 1960s. Ooh, I wonder what this could present could be. It was nothing. I was able to collect the key to the dungeon, but I was never able to collect the key to her heart. This game is actually quite pretty. I mean, look at that lighting and these textures. I'm I'm actually really liking this. This is, this is probably going to be one of the longest cuts in this whole video because I'm actually going to put some effort into this video now and get it cut. And oh gosh, oh gosh, there's beetles everywhere. Anyways, yeah, this game is actually very, very pretty and very, very nice. I am liking it. All right, so we probably have to sacrifice a virgin here or we could just stand on it. Hmm... Apparently we just had to stand on it. Oh, that wasn't that wasn't a pot. Okay, that was unexpected. Anyways, let's continue through. Okay, let's not continue through here. Run, 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 run. <sighs> They'll never find me here. Ah, uh, yes. The beetle has adopted a new strategy. It is called the sleep. Ah, so the crystals must increase your mana, which I assume is... I assume that's mana down there. Oh gosh, there that's a lot of beetles. I assume that's mana for magic and stuff if you're a magic class. I don't know though. Let's just continue. Ugh. Ugh. There's caterpillar. I, I think... Well, I died. Oh, there's so many caterpillars over there. I might actually hate caterpillars more than spiders. They're all shiny and uh, hairy in, in real life, at least. Ugh, I hate caterpillars. And that, kids, is called a rave. Do I smash the pots and get the key, or do I face the bats? Why not both? Oh, I appear to have discovered a secret on accident. Let's see where this leads. <gasps> oh, secret. That's a big coin, but I, I like these pots better. Let's grab this coin. What does it do? A vendor coin. Interesting. Can I use it to buy more pots? I've waited for this moment my entire life. It was completely useless. I appear to have been decapitated. So that was fun. Is it worth it? Is it really worth it? Hey, Nike Mato, just do it. <laughs> it was worth it. Oh, okay, they can actually come through there. That's scary. I thought that they were getting blocked off. No, oh gosh. Where do we go? There's caterpillars coming from every direction, and they're firing goop at me. Let's just run through the bats, the less scary, slimy bats. Run. Okay, there's caterpillars everywhere now. There is no escape. There is no hope. I must fight to survive. Why are, why why can the golden ones shoot stuff at me? Why? Why why can't the silver ones do anything? Why why are there even why are there even caterpillars in here? Where are we even? This looks like a dungeon or a basement or something. Is it is this the binding of Isaac? Okay, do we go for the key or do we risk the caterpillars? I say we just run in and cry in a corner. Why are there so many pots? I mean, who even needs this many pots? And why are they all full of money? Wouldn't someone put something like wine or wine or 
drugs or something in pots? Why is it all just full of money? I appear to have Harry Pottered myself through a wall. Do I Ooh, a strange plank. Oh, I'm that, I'm that kid from Ed and Eddie. <laughs> run, 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 smash the pots and run. Oh, that wasn't a pot. That was not a gift at all. Some okay, so they store coins and bombs in their pots. These people are very, 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 very strange. They've also got a serious insect problem. They should probably get that figured out. Ooh, die, die, you die, you die, die. Just die everything. Please die, please die, please die. I need to save the guy from Thief. Please die. Thank you, thank you. You're all dead. Okay, goodbye. Go to sleep. But first, pots. Well, that didn't last very long. How about we try Temple of the Sun now, except let's be a... this one. A thief. To gain access to the pyramid, complete the first part of the trial by locating and activating the six small pyramids. Okay, really, who would put that much effort into just opening the pyramid? They're wizards, can't they just cast a spell on it? Like, put some Avada Kedavra on or whatever? Serious, no. Ooh, we have entered into the Temple of the Sun. I have no idea if this is where we were supposed to go. Yawn. Well, apparently it wasn't where we were supposed to go. So anyways, guys, that was Hammer Watch. It's actually quite a fun game. I played a bunch of co-op with my friends a few nights ago. I still don't really know what's going on. I didn't know that there weren't infinite lives in the campaign. That, that kind of stinks. But anyways, guys, pretty fun game. It's pretty cheap in the Steam store. Uh, it's on sale regularly. You can find it for about $3. But I, I, I recommend it. I had some fun. So anyways, guys, thank you all very, very much for watching. If you liked this video, then be sure to like the video and subscribe to my channel for some more awesome content. I will see you all next time, and I'm off to just wander in the desert by myself with this peasant. A man and his feelings. And an iPad with an E-Trade app. Goodbye.